Okay. Hi guys, welcome to today's uh, video. So guys, you remember, you remember the other village where I got an accident from? The, the leg where I got a leg accident when I was hiking. Actually, I think it was our first hike of 2024. So, uh, you remember I met, I met some kids who were collecting firewood and then I went to their home and I promised to go back to their home. So today, I'm going back to this family just to say hi, but I also miss the kids because I promised the, the little girls that I will come back and one of the little girls was so attached to me like we bonded in a short period of time with one little girl so it has been a, like a date on my heart wanting to go back to this family so schools have started in Uganda it's, I, I, it's now two weeks since school started so I felt like today, today's weekend, I was free. So I felt like let me go back to these people. Let me just go and say hi and take the little I have. You know guys, I don't have a lot. I really don't have, but it's better to give the little you have than to wait for bigger things. Because you never know when the bigger things will come. Remember, this family, they don't know that I'm coming. You know? They don't know that I'm coming because it has been a while since I met them. I'm sure they even gave up on waiting for me. And two, I also don't know if they are at home. So just cross hands for me because I don't know if they are there, if they are at home. And they also, they don't expect me to come. <laughs> we are almost there. But I want to show you something. You see, everywhere there are rocks. There are rocks everywhere, heaps, heaps of rocks everywhere in the gardens because it's rocky so they collect the stones together like this and then there will be space for them to plant coffee. It's something I'm just learning. All the way I've been observant and I was asking myself where are they so many heaps? Oops. Well, why are there so many heaps of rocks all over the way? Now I understand why they want to get soil. Yes, you remember the rocks? The rock, these are the rocks that attracted me to this village. The rocks up there. So after those rocks, that's the home. Ah, I hope, I pray God. I'm praying that they are home. Guys, sorry about my voice. I have some kind of cough. But I'm just praying that they are home because we are just close. Like after those rocks up there, we, we will be home. Yeah. yeah. Oh, there are so many dogs at home. And, oh my God, I hope there is somebody at home. Oh my God, I don't know. Oh. They built a kitchen. The last time we came, they didn't have a kitchen. Cody, Cody. Cody, Cody. Okay. I think we have to wait. We have to wait and see who is coming. But one thing for sure, I want to set the camera here. <laughs> I want to set a camera and see their reaction. I want to see how they react. 
when they see me. So, so guys I'm home I found when nobody was here I waited and now this is a uh, my my best friend is not yet here <laughs> this one is Ronette and also guys uh, the mom the mom is not here she has gone for a safari and she's coming back after two days so sad but it's okay because the kids they still remember they still rem <laughs> i'm so surprised that they still remember me very well and she's telling me they thought i was not going coming back but also she's saying uh you know my best friend is the little one it's called kabuo she said the kabuo that day i told i said i'll come back she was waiting for the whole day and even asked for the mom to call and remember it's me who took the number and i lost it i misplaced the number <laughs> i will apologize to her when she comes <laughs> uh yeah so this is my talkie guys that remember oh i'm feeling my talkie i'm going to help her so that uh, we can cook so fast because it's, it's late she left the food here and she went to play <laughs> let me help her and we do this first and then we do other things yeah guys my voice i have cough but i'm so excited i can't wait to see kabo because she's my favorite and also she was telling me ha huh, your kabo is not here i'm going to spend the whole day guys i'm going to spend the whole day here and i'm sure within the day we are going to have fun. We are going to have fun. That's a little boy. The little boy is from the neighborhood. He has a car. Ah. Okay, our food is finally ready. It's literally uh, my first time eating this type of matoke. Matoke, what you run it? Oh, a bogoy. Hey, Kabia, ma. Run it another. Hey, Kabia, can you eat Kabia? Can you so guys, um, this one is matoke. Matoke is like um, banana, <laughs> green banana. So it is my first time doing this, eating this type of matoke. Because I, all I know is this type of uh, matoke is for bananas. Like it's for, you're supposed to leave them to ripe. 
and then eat them as bananas. So I was so surprised because I even asked Ronette, like these ones look like bananas, and she was like, yeah, they are edible. And to be honest, they are sweet. They are tasting like plantain. If you know plantain, plantain is goncha. So they are tasting like goncha. So if you know the taste of goncha, and you have bogoya, <laughs> but this one, the improved bogoya, guys. You have bogoya, uh, that's green matoke, green bananas, before they ripe to real bananas, oh, yeah. but you want to have a different taste of bananas. This one here is perfect because it is really plantain. Like, actually, kasange gonja, eh? And this is my first time, but they are, they are tasting really good. Run it! We have to this one. The other thing I've liked about the village is uh, we are eating together. Like, guys, I'm learning a lot because we are eating together and remember we here the, it's a family of of four people ronet lodrick and kawuo my best friend and the little baby then mom and dad so they are five but what i love about the what i've liked so much about the village is like the whole village is part of you like i feel like this is missing in town because in town it's me and my babies and that's it and there are few families in town who who invite other families to their homes so i'm feeling so touched i'm feeling so in love with the village life because it's literally like you are a family like the whole village is a family they came to say hi to me I don't know like they came to say hi to me we are eating together oh my god i'm feeling i know i i know i i, I don't know if you can feel what i feel but i'm feeling so touched this is like something i miss miss a lot uh calling everyone my family like even my even the neighbor coming to my home and we have a chat the children of your neighbor being your children you can take care of them they can take care of your children when you are away this one is missing in town. Actually, if you're in town, I feel like in town is more lonely. Rodrick, Rodrick, the Karaherio. I think like the town is more is more of a lonely life because it's just you and your children, and that's it. But here, it's you, your neighbor. you your neighbor and your children's neighbor are also your children time for eating is for everyone which is so guys so perfect so perfect for me this is a perfect life i always want actually that's why i always want to go in the village because like everybody is your is your best friend ronet is there she's already cleaning up oh, guys the other thing is ronet is hard working because like she's the one Ma her mother left, uh, she went for a visit, for a safari, and she done has been taking care of the home. Like I can see she's so hard working, like she's doing everything on time, nobody's telling her to do it. So this is so nice. Yeah, it's really nice. I love her. I, have, I love her courage. She's so hard working. And generally that's it guys. That's it is logic. That one, this one follows my best friend. Kabo is my best friend in this family. It's even the reason why I came. But unfortunately, she's not around. So, yeah, guys. So, all right. See you in the next video, guys. I uh, love you. Thank you for coming with me to in this village. Actually, this village is called Chihara. Chihara. Like, the town is down. And then up here is Chihara uphill. <laughs> it's Chihara uphill, guys. All right, I love you, and let me know what you think about this video for me. I've learned a lot today. You see, I'm even humble, by the way. Today I'm humble because I'm so amazed, I'm so surprised, I'm learning a lot. I am loving the life here. I want to sleep over, but it's not possible uh, because I have to go home in the evening. Yeah. All right. See you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye.
that's her. You see how hard working she is. Now she has gone to other things. And now we are going and also we are going to the river. Alright, bye. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright guys. Hi. Hey guys, it's not Ronet is looking new. <laughs> Ronet, yeah. guys, I'm going back home. It's unfortunate I've not seen mom because she went, but I've seen uh, another mama. Is Ronet's mom. You know, I told you guys, like here in the village, your closest neighbor, we are always like family. So she, I've met her. She's so nice. She's a nice one. And then they wanted me. And I can't sleep, guys. I'll sleep next time. Okay, guys. Mama, I can't